A typical explosion detection sequence begins when a spark or other ignition source ignites particulate in a vessel. The resulting deflagration grows at an exponential pace as the material burns. The pressure front preceding the deflagration expands, reaching the pressure detector connected to the explosion protection control panel, which processes 4,000 data points per second. The system alarms at a preset pressure level and activates the gas cartridge actuators on the suppression and isolation devices. The system maintains a history of the event for future reference. The gas cartridge actuator drives the piston on the isolation valve, closing the slide gate, and provides mechanical isolation which prevents the propagation of the explosion through the ductwork to interconnected vessels. The actuator opens a rupture disc on the suppressor bottle that uses nitrogen pressurized to 900 PSI to drive suppressant into the vessel, filling the entire cavity and extinguishing the advancing deflagration. It is also necessary to isolate the deflagration, preventing the transmission of the flame into interconnected vessels. The system simultaneously opens a rupture disc on an isolation container that uses 500 PSI of nitrogen to drive suppressant into the ductwork, providing a chemical isolation barrier that prevents the propagation of the explosion. Vike's explosion protection system effectively saves lives and property from explosion damage.